Well, you know that every week, Better Call Harry is working very hard to get you results. I don't know when he sleeps, right? Um, how many resolutions would you guess Harry's achieved thus far? Mm, see, I can't, I already know the number. Okay, Harry we, I joins to Harry us about now this earlier. to mark the milestone. <laughs> Why'd you tell him? I was going to guess the number, yeah. but I think that's that's your it's, big it's delivery. Astounding. It's we didn't start incredible. counting for until now. You know, we've been doing this for a few years. Okay. So it was wow. time to start adding things up because we realized, you know, we we've helped a lot of people. Yeah. So including today, right? Because you got one today. Yeah. Well, that's the tease. I'm going to tell yeah. you in a second. All right. All right. We got. Okay. We got. We got to do. do this. We have Sorry. to do the setup. I'm so first. excited for him. Yeah, it is exciting, <laughs> Harry. It's like the lottery. All right. So the goal was first to help viewers by resolving disputes, and second to educate. So the same thing doesn't happen to you. So at first we were just trying to get this thing going and we were not keeping track, but now we are. And I'm happy to say that as of today, we have resolved 250 cases. Wow. And then we added it up because 250 doesn't sound like a lot, but a slightly bigger number here That's that you incredible. see. To date, we have recovered $612,960 and I have to change that. Instead of 250, we just hit 251 it as is. of this afternoon. A better call, uh, a better call. Harry producer Phil Riley resolved another one. So I'm not the only one right. doing this. Yeah. Uh, we, we've got a team that's actually doing this. It's so fantastic because there's also those stories that Harry does that are priceless for folks mm -hmm. because there's uh, an older lady that was taken advantage of that you helped because she was apparently, uh, I hate to say it, but she was dead. She was dead. Yeah. And you, but she wasn't dead. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> and before we roll that video, we'll talk about that real quick. But yeah, there was the woman who Social Security decided she was dead, emptied her bank account, stopped her Medicare, Medicaid, the, the whole thing. And we came in and helped. And then we, we continued on uh, to help some other folks, uh, kind of like Northwest Neurology. Um, I don't know if we've got some video that we can show there. Uh, Northwest Neurology is another big one where actually that's a different couple. That we you helped. You know so what? I'm just going to refer. There's so many. You know them all by and, name. And now they've switched. So they're showing a couple that we helped with the cruise. This is Northwest Neurology. We helped these folks recover about $200,000. Wow. When the the head neurologist at this practice passed away, and they canceled his ID for claims for all the patients, but then they canceled the entire office. So that they, doesn't, that's not good. So no claims were being processed at all. This is one of the doctors here. His wife said, hey, you better call Harry. So they did. And that's the stack of claims you're looking at right there. So we called Johnny Isaacson's office and uh, they like literally overnight. And it's funny because some cases will take two or three months to resolve. This one was resolved before we even went to the doctor's office. They actually called us to cancel the story. They're right. like, no, we're good. We're gonna we be able to process this. Right. I'm like, no, 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 no. no, no, no. That's not how it works. No, right? That's not how it works. <laughs> we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna go out there. So yeah, that was worth $200,000 in claims right there. We also there. saw a clip of a woman uh, that uh, I think you, if I remember correctly, and it was a quick clip that we saw her, but you got her lottery check. Yes. You, that that it, she had expired it by I'm one saying day. That, I'm saying that that counts for 50 grand right there. That it was does. Like $50,000. And the check, ex the check, uh, 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 it expired. She missed it by a day. She missed it by a day. You know, the, the checks are good for 180 days. Yeah. And she went on day 181. I'm like, why did she wait that long? I know, <laughs> but she did. Let's just say she wasn't hurting for the cash. I was right. going to say, she had a nice house. Remember yeah, that house? She, that was a good house. house. She had a nice house, yeah. but you know, it's about but, the principle. And I just don't know how you're able to just figure it out, whether you're dealing with a medical issue or something else. But I want to know something else. 250 one now more than six hundred thousand dollars how many times have you been kissed and hugged and I've been hugged a lot i've been kissed and then as you guys are going to see pretty soon this coming wednesday i got shot at uh earlier oh, this week that was that. A, yeah well he didn't actually shoot at me but he went on his back porch and he fired off a couple of shotgun blasts yeah, it was a bad pool contractor who dug a hole, collected 40000 and then just kind of moved on. That story next Wednesday. <laughs> wow, that's a really good deep tease. Uh-huh. Well, why yeah. should be careful, Harry? Yeah, obviously, people need you around. Yeah, well, I, I told him. I said, hey, I, I think that's a sign for us to leave. <laughs> good point. He's a smart man. Look, you, you keep your wits about you, Harry, all right? Because we right. need you around here. But thank you, and congratulations. That's yeah. a big Job number. well done. Thank Very you. Very well done.